All right, so I want to look at the difference between saving and exporting a file. This is a common issue in GIMP that uh, we run into in class all the time. So you have your image, whatever it may be, and you want to continue working on it, or you want to have it in case you need to come back and do something to it. In that case, what you want to do is go to File, Save As, I'm working from home, so I can't show you this exactly, but you want to make sure it's in your personal drive. Um, the first folder or second folder here that just has your username or your name is not your personal drive. It's going to be down lower. It's going to have your username, a whole bunch of stuff after it. Uh, if you mouse over, it'll have uh, P in parentheses at the end of it like this. But that just saves a GIMP file, nothing but a GIMP file. That is not an image. You know, if you want to come back later and uh, bring that file into page plus, for example, a GIMP file does you no good. A GIMP file ends with .xcf. If you want something you can bring into page plus or a similar program or something that you're going to turn in as an image in class, uh, you need to do something slightly different. You need to go to export. And this is going to give us some different options. Again, you would make sure it goes to your personal drive. But uh, to make life very simple for us in class, there are tons of different types of file formats. Uh, we're not going to get into all these. I'll make life very simple for us. If you have a photograph, take the ending here and change it to .jpg, JPEG. If you have something with a lot of text, um, if you have something with transparency, something along those lines, like my egg here for egg drop, save it as .png. Um, one thing to make sure of, because I've seen this happen, is make sure that there's only one period and ending on there. Don't add, right now I have .png, I would not add .png jpg to the end that will not work it will not like that at all so just one ending but um again png a lot of text a lot of line art things like that um, transparency if it's a photograph dot jpg 